Hey Planner friends, how's it going? Thanks so much for stopping by my channel. My name is Ryan and this is the man with the plans and we are back in my Erin Condren colorful hourly here. We are gonna do a monthly view spread. Um, I actually ordered a kit from Soda Pop Studios. Here it is, it's super cute. The font is amazing. Um, let's, I haven't even opened it as you can tell. But let's uh, open this guy up and see what's in here and then we will go ahead and get started. Uh, March is a fun month for me, partly because it's my birthday month. Um, yeah, but so in this kit you've got two sheets here well, So you've got the headers across the top that say March you've got some fun payday flags. Oh, you got a little leprechaun and Then oh, thank goodness. They don't do the date covers Whew. Okay, so we don't have to waste forever doing that with this video, but yeah, I thought this was a really fun kit I actually funnily enough. I don't know where it is here I did order my usual planner cake kit for March, and I think I might use this for my budget, although we lost a circle, so I don't know what happened there. But this will probably be my budget planner, um, but I saw this one and I figured, you know what, what the heck, let's give it a shot. So let's go ahead and get started. You all know that I am not great at doing the headers, so we are going to give it a shot. I will also say again, I love that the date ones are attached to it, so you don't have to sort of do it do two sets of headers which makes my life easier because if you've ever watched a video of me doing this I will leave a link to one of my other monthly view ones up there the February one I'll leave linked over there you know that I am not the best sticker placer ever um, yeah so like this one's a little off but that I'll just have to do we'll flip to this side so yeah, I love the month of March. Uh, normally, it, yeah, so my birthday, but also like I do love that the seasons, hopefully, God willing, Minnesota will start to move into spring. Uh, I feel like the last couple of years, it's gotten nice and warm and then sometime towards the end of March or April, um, the weather jokes with us and we end up with a snowstorm. Last year was two feet in April, which was hilarious. And hilarious I'm using as sarcastically as I possibly can because I, I think we were just ready for spring to be here so that was a struggle but we survive we live on so yeah we get this down um, as an Irish person well person with Irish heritage I'm not Irish by nationality well but like whatever you know what I mean um, I am a big fan of that so now that those are done, I already think it's super festive. I did love the teal, the, like the light blue, but I, I think I'm gonna switch it. So now we have these little covers at the bottom, which I think are so fun, and they do line up pretty well with the Erin Condren ones. So we got Ash Wednesday. We have Daylight Savings Time. This is the one that kills me. Fall back is nice, because you get an extra hour of sleep. But I feel like spring ahead messes with me, where I'm like delirious for like a week at a time. So hopefully I can shape up and figure all that out. St. Patrick's Day is on a Sunday, which is interesting. So I'm assuming the festivities will shift over to um, the the Saturday. Cause I, I feel like we'd all have an awful Monday. And then finally, the long awaited spring sighting has appeared. So that will be very nifty. I can't wait. Oh, too bad it's a little bit crooked. The only thing I will say is that with the spring one here, you can see that covering it up, you will still get one or two of the flowers, right? So, yeah, see there's a little flower sticking up at the top from Erin Condren's ones, but I don't think it's a huge deal. It's not going to bother me in the slightest. Let's go ahead now and add in some paydays. We'll add these stickers up top here. I actually get paid this Friday, the 8th, and then I get paid which other one? I get paid on this day, the 22nd. Oh, that's cool. And then, so for those of you that don't know, I also recently started a new side hustle. So that one is, I, we get paid every Wednesday, but I'm only going to cash it out, I think, maybe twice a month because that way one will go to, to offset some of the taxes and then the other one will be used then to help sort of move some of my debt snowball along. I will leave a Dave Ramsey video up in the top for you. So then for Bildu, I often don't use these, but I figured we'll test out the full kit this way. 
I've got my rent this day. And then I also have the first part of my car payment that day. Oh no, it's this week. Which means the second part of my car payment is going to be this day. So I'm just trying to use as much of this kit as I can. I, uh, I love trying out a new kit. I do love the way that these stickers are coming down and the look of it is nice. It's I'm a big fan. The only thing I will say is it did take a while to get here, but I, I believe they're cut to order, so that makes sense then, in my opinion. So that wraps up paydays and bill dues. I'm sure there's more in there. Um, first things first, though, we will add my 28th birthday over here. So Ryan turns 28. Yay! And what I'll do is there's some fun little icons on here. Obviously, I'm not going to use all of these ever. Like, there's a nail polish one, which I don't think I'll ever really use. But hey, it's fun to pretend, right? So I will use a little cheers glass and a little, little gift thing. Yeah, that's so cute. Awesome. So then, that's the one big exciting thing. The next thing we'll do is, doesn't happen, I don't even got to it every year, but last year, my friend and I went to this thing called Lucky Palooza in St. Paul, and we had such a good time. So I'm hoping we get to go again if the weather decides to cooperate. Honestly, I had so much fun last time. It was literally the funniest thing. Um, and then Monday is a big day for me. The 18th, I start my new job. So it's a transfer within the county, so same agency but um, different department, which is exciting. So there'll be a lot of fun stuff going on. And then Wednesday before is gonna be my going away happy hour. My office wanted to have one for me, so I thought that was sweet of them. Also, you can tell that none of these things are coming in centered, but that's just what you get when, I, when you plan with me. <laughs> There you go. So the happy hour is done. Um, my uncle's birthday is the 21st. Um, so I'll be sure to give him a call. Fellow March birthday. And I also think my grandmother's birthday is in March as well. I can't remember the date. Ah, I think it's like the 14th or the 15th. I should probably remember that. Not so good. We'll add that down. Ah, sure, we'll just say it's here. Mom, if you're watching, can you just shoot me a text and verify what her birthday is? <laughs> I can't believe I just did that over the internet, but it's all good. Yeah, so then the last thing I'm gonna do is I think take this sticker and kind of just toss it over here. I can feel like this is already starting to peel up a little bit, so make sure that if you're gonna mess up your um, placement of these, you should just make sure to get it done the first time because I can already tell I'm going to be fighting with this for it to stay down. And I'm going to do something with this around goals and intentions for the month. So every Sunday, Jen and I, my new boss, and also a good friend of mine, we have a meeting to set intentions for the work that we have to get done that week. And so... We have a meeting, we just, we talk about all sorts of stuff, but I love the fact that we're intentional about that, so I'm adding in the appointments here. But, you know, stuff just like, you know, there's one thing that I've been doing in my weekly spread, which you'll see in my plan with me from this week, I'll add that up there, about just like being intentional and taking screen, taking screen time away. So like, I am trying to be better about not using my phone. Uh, so that's one of the goals that I have is 30 minutes, no screen time before bed. Um, that's just for me to try to sleep better. I feel like I've been struggling with that. And then the other one that I put in my budget one, lunch from home, four times per week. Because I've been recently spending a ton of money on lunch. And so for me to remember like, hey, bring your stinking lunch from home, you usually make something delicious anyhow. Um, that to me is like a really great way to save some money. 
And then the last thing that I put in my budget planner, which is no spends. And I'm gonna be crazy this month, and I'm shooting for 20. So that's gonna be really interesting. Fingers crossed I can get that done, because that would be super duper amazing. So some things that I didn't get to use on here, right? I didn't get to use some of these glittery header sticker majiggers, but I think they'd be fun for a trip or somewhere you're going, none of which I'm really up to this month. Um, there's a bit more of the appointment boxes down here that honestly I haven't gone into. There's also a whole bunch of icon stickers. There's car, stethoscope, school, TV, light bulbs, some other bills, water, a movie. So I'll probably go back and fill some of that in. But overall, I'm really happy with the sticker sheet and I'm really happy with how this look turned out. I think it's super fun for the month of March. Hopefully we'll see some green coming in the future. What are you doing for the month of March? Which kit did you use? Do you use a monthly kit? This is one of the things I really loved. Um, let me know in the comment box down below. Um, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, go ahead and hit it, it's up over there. Um, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I make new videos every Monday and every Thursday. You can find me over on Instagram, at A Man With The Plans. You can find me over on Facebook, also at A Man With The Plans. And until next time, planner friends, bye.